what's going on youtube i'm back again with another video man make sure you like comment subscribe and we're gonna get right back into it now this video is gonna be a quick video explaining to y'all why you should never pay a collection account like it make me cringe when people pay collection accounts i'm gonna give y'all a few reasons why <laughs> all right so the first reason is that what y'all got to understand about credit is that a collection account is a derogatory mark as a whole all right so the balance doesn't necessarily matter, right? A $5,000 collection and a $0 collection will hurt you basically the same way. So if you pay that collection without getting to pay for a delete letter, then all they're going to do is turn the balance on the collection to zero. And then you'll still be stuck with a collection on your credit report. So basically, they just took your money and it didn't help your credit at all. All right. That's the main reason why I tell people not to pay the collections all right <clears throat> it's something is that it's something that you know it went into the collections and now just dispute it just use learn the laws and everything like that and then just dispute it all right if you don't know how to dispute it just click the link down in the description and my team can help you out with that all right um but learn the laws dispute it um but yeah just don't pay it because you just lose leverage when you pay a collection, right? If you pay that collection, now it's a $0 collection. Now it's like, it can still be removed because I removed a collection before that was paid. But at the same time, it's like you lose a little bit of leverage because you really can't do a debt validation letter. You paid it. You can't do like a refusal to pay. You paid it already. So it's like you just lose a lot of leverage when it comes to getting it deleted. Now it can still be deleted, but you just lose leverage. It can make it a little tougher, right? Whether you just don't pay it and just have like my team and I dispute it or you dispute it on your own, All right? So that's like the main two reasons for me. They're not going to delete it off your credit report. All they're going to do is turn that balance to zero and then you lose leverage when you do pay it. All right, so the best thing for y'all to be doing if you have collections on your credit report is disputing it so it can end up being deleted off your file. You want it gone completely. You do not want the balance to be zero. And then people always come to me and say, hey, bro, I paid this collection. This is that. It's still on my credit report. People don't know. All right. People don't know. So that's my video for today. Like I said, just a little recap. Do not pay these collections and make sure you dispute it. All right. I'm going to give you all a little cheat code. Use 15 USC 1692 it is the FDCPA, the Fair Debt Collection Practices Act which governs collection companies. All right, so go there, 15 USC 1692, and there's laws in there that will work in your favor to delete some negative collections on your credit report. All right, because they got to go. All right, so that's my video for today, man. If y'all got collections, definitely don't pay it. Click the link down in the description if you want assistance to um, like deleting collections and everything like that, if you need assistance. Uh, click the link down below. Uh, email or call my team member and then they'll set you up an appointment all right so that's my video for today man make sure y'all like comment subscribe and i'm gonna see y'all in the next video